Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. This is Basil Chapman with a live Tiger Financial News Network 9 a.m. market update on this uh, Friday, the 15th of March. We're looking at the Dow futures up 53 at 39,400 uh, after a fairly weak session yesterday, not that weak. Looking at the E mini uh, SP, uh, the futures up $1.75 at 5220. Uh, it's had uh, five sessions in which to kind of break to a new high. It hasn't really done that yet. Just starting to see a little bit of weakness uh, creeping in. NQ, that's the uh, NDX 100 trading vehicle. At the NQ uh, futures trading down 17 at 18,254. Now, this has had a, a, a much steeper arch formation with a nine period moving average. I'll talk about that in the next show coming up. I'm doing uh, Tommy O'Brien's. Uh, market morning morning market kickoff uh, you can see that nine period moving average is getting much closer to crossing negative hasn't yet looking at the IWM that's the RTY that's the futures uh, down quite sharply forgot to update that it made a PG at the top there <clears throat> it is up 280 at 2059 uh, it's it's kind of struggling here yet again the IWM is really close to turning negative let's go to the uh, bonds bonds right now are <clears throat> trading about unchanged at 118 28 30 seconds looking at gold gold is um, actually doing quite nicely it's down just one at 21 66 after a massive move to the upside and now it's just kind of digesting those gains and we're looking at the dollar the dollar had a nice session yesterday today it's uh, about unchanged at 103.37 and crude oil has been really on the move and today it is down just a fraction at 81.18 and I've been looking at this and saying if it gets to the 80 to 82 area that's something new because it hasn't been there for a year so that's something to be monitoring we're looking at that in great detail I'll be back in a few moments for a morning market kickoff show that's that's the hour that Tommy does I'll be doing that and then I'll do my show the Tiger Nations Hour don't forget this coming Tuesday, I'll be doing a webinar for subscribers on the technical tools needed for the next few months. I'll be back in a few moments. Look forward to seeing you.